What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here. Uh, so happy to be teaching you one of the most classic acoustic tunes ever. Uh, in this lesson, we're going to be breaking down that intro and then the chords that follow for the rest of the song. Uh, be sure to check out my other videos that teach that opening solo as well. Uh, also, appreciate all your support. Please subscribe to this new channel of mine and leave comments uh, about other lessons you want to learn and anything else. Uh, and anyway, enough of that. Let's zoom in and start breaking this one down right now. Here we go! All right, so let's break this one down. What's going to happen is we're playing uh, an E minor, a G chord, and what's kind of called an A, well, it is, it's called an A7 sus4, which sounds fancy, but really what we want to do for this whole intro is we're going to have our pinky on the third fret of the high E and our ring finger on the third fret of the B string. And that's going to stay for, you know, pretty much, well, it's going to stay for the whole intro. So check it out. If I have a G chord, the middle finger's on the third, index is on the second here. And if you just mute the A string with your middle finger, you get kind of a cleaner G chord. It's called a G5. But either way you play G, that's all good. So you have the G chord. And then we have the E minor chord while we're holding that down. And these two right here, if you scoot them over, so it's the second fret of the D and second fret of the G, holding these, forget the low E, That's the A sus A7 sus4. So you have E minor, G, and A7 sus4. And then the licks that go on are really outlining the chords. So if you play those chords well, the licks are fun and outline the chord shapes. So I'll show you what I mean. The first thing, remember, we'll just keep those glued on. The first thing we're gonna do is this. And what happens is it just looks like that E minor chord, but we're going to hit the open A, and then we're going to hammer on to the second fret of the A string. Then the open D string. And then middle finger on the second fret of that D string. And then we hold that E minor chord right after. So it looks like this. And then we strum the chord. And he varies the rhythm, but whenever he does, uh, it, it, the pulse is pretty much down, 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 or, you know. Just strong strum, down strums on the one, two, three, four, and you can do up strums. And then you can even syncopate it more. But they're all real straight. Okay, so let's go over that lick again. Then we're going to play the open G. Then the D string holding this chord still. Then we take our finger off. So it goes. And then we go to that G5 chord. If it's easier for you to play the full G, that's fine. I'm playing the G5 where the A is muted. Like that. So let's start from the beginning. These lock down. This time, we're going to play the exact same thing, but instead of, we have a little lead in note where our finger already is on that G, so the third fret of the low E. 
So we've just added that pickup note, but the rest stays the same. So let's do it from the top. Same thing again. Same thing again. New thing. So let's pick it up right before that new thing. We have the third fret of the low E, hammer on the second, open D, second fret D, E minor strum. Check it out. We're, we're holding that E minor down. We're going to play the D string, then take our finger off and play that string again. And then we'll do the same thing on the A string, once with our finger down, then once with it off. And then we go to that A7 sus4, and he definitely goes da 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 da. He does a faster strum, da 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 da. But even if, as long as you're just getting that one, two, three, four. If you can feel those downbeats, you're gonna be good. All right, so check it out. From the top, nice and slow. Seven sus. Now it doesn't do the pickup note there because we're on this. It's going to just do that very first thing we did. And then the second, the new A sus thing again. Then a hammer on of the open A second fret just like we did in the very beginning, then the open D, and then the G chord. And then it repeats the whole thing again, and that's when the solo comes in, which will be in, the, in another video. So let's take the whole thing from the top, and I'll do it nice and slow for you. All right, here we go. These are locked in. Seven sus four. No pickup note. New thing again. A seven sus four. Hammer on the second fret of the A string. Open D, and then a hold on G strum. Starts again.
And that gets you through that whole intro without the solo. So now let's get to the rest of the song where the actual singing is. And it's just nice, easy chord. So it goes, and you can just think of down, down, down. It's still that pulse, but you could go down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down. You just want to feel that pulse of those downs. Like that, and it starts on a C major chord. Three, two, open G, first on the B. So one, two, three, so you think you can D chord. Then A minor. So we got the A minor next. So we have C, D, A minor, and then G, so check it out. C, C, C to D. Heaven A minor. Blue do to G. Then we go back to D. Then the C. Then A minor. G. Here it is again, C to D. A minor. Then we're going to go to G. Then we go to D. Then we're going to go to C. Go to A minor. Then we go back to G. And one more time, C chord. How I see, how I see to D. Heaven A minor. Blue skies from G. Don't forget back to D. Minor's next. A minor. Back to G. Let's do the intro again. There was a lesson. I hope you got something from it. Uh, be sure to subscribe to this new channel of mine. This is where I'm going to be from here on out. And also leave comments about what you would uh, like to learn. And also I've always got links down uh, below this box down here for you to check out. New website and all that stuff. And thanks so much for the support. We'll see you again real soon. Take care.